All right, boys. So as many of you guys already know, we have a brand new Vanguard shotgun in the game this season. And honestly, we don't care about that shotgun for today's video because we're gonna be taking a look at the old Vanguard shotgun, the Xenoclast. Now don't worry, that doesn't mean I'm not gonna make a video on the new Vanguard shotgun. I'm just trying to get a good roll with opening shot first because I don't really wanna judge that thing without opening shot because it really does make that big of a difference. Regardless though, back to the Xenoclast. Now I know a lot of you guys are probably a little bit confused as to why I'm making a video on this gun out of literally all of the new ones that were added with Witch Queen, but here's the thing. This is actually the only farmable energy lightweight shotgun in the entire game right now. And if you don't believe me, I'll quickly show you guys the collections tab real quick. There's only two other energy lightweight shotguns in the entire game that aren't sunset at the moment, which are the Retro Futurist and the Seven Seraph CQC. Now here's the thing, Retro Futurist is completely unattainable at the moment. There's no way to get the shotgun. And the Seven Seraph CQC is only farmable once every four weeks through Dares of Eternity. So your best bet is by far the Xenoclast. Not to mention, you haven't actually been able to farm the Xenoclast since around season 12, so it's been a minute. Now the role I have on mine is Rifled Barrel, Light Mag, Auto Loading, Killing Wind, and a Range Masterwork. This isn't a god roll by any means like that. I would say it's pretty good, but you know, unfortunately we don't have full choke, so that kind of does suck. But outside of that, not a bad roll at all. I'm going to be pairing the Xenoclast with the Time Lost Fatebringer, Chaos Reach, Ophidian Aspects, and all of these armor mods right here. Anyways, I will see you guys in the crucible. Well, this is a good way to start the video. We're already down by like uh, 70 points. Pretty, pretty nice. Stop the cap. <laughs> Stop the cap right now. Stop the cap. I'm going to try to ape this guy on my left with the sh... What in the hell was... Okay, I... I guess I forgot that I joined late and people are already going to have heavy ammo and supers and whatnot. Also, I didn't expect the guy to just be chilling in the corner like that. I thought he was going to move, but uh, I guess not. Bro, I just can't seem to catch a break. We're going to go for the shotgun on that guy. Completely whiff it. We finally got the kill. That nade almost one-shot me. What the actual hell? Well, that was a very fun match. Yeah, it literally is already over. I'll see you guys in the next one. So we're in Rumble this time around, and that is... I thought that was a rocket launcher, but I was like, okay, there's literally zero shot that guy can have a rocket launcher two seconds into the match. So it was a grenade launcher, and we actually didn't die there, which is good. I low-key need to find this penguin guy. He's popping off. I'm going to help this other guy in the fight because I really don't want that guy to get any more points. That guy's dead right there. I'm going to try my best to get as many shoddy kills as possible. And my, I, uh, I might have to get some with a hand cannon. We're going to push this guy right here. He's dead. There's another guy in the building to, uh, to the right over here. This guy's literally not playing the game. I actually choked my shot, which is really, really bad. This, uh, this is the sniper player right here. Don't really want to get body shots. I'm like 99% sure this guy's coming through. That was really not a good idea by him because I was just kind of camping that after my last fight. I snagged this uh, green right here. This guy might challenge me. GL player, we're gonna uh, slide that. Wait, what GL is that? Is that the new one? Another player coming up from behind. He's dead as well. Dude, this shotgun is actually pretty good, especially without a uh, slide shot or full choke. Not bad at all. Um, what, what is this bungee? Scene. What is that bungee? That is so bad. That is actually so, I feel bad for that guy. That is a genuinely horrible spawn point. Another player in the back over here. We're gonna try this motherfucker don't miss. No, he's fucking good. That motherfucker don't miss, man. He's good. Honestly, that death right there was definitely my fault. I should have taken uh, note that that guy had Uzume because if you guys didn't know, Uzume actually has one of the biggest uh, cones in the game. It's one of the easiest snipers to use and it's really, really accurate. There should be somebody. Oh my God, what the hell? That is not what I was expecting. We're gonna go for the uh, double shot on this guy. Unfortunately, like I said before, we don't have assault mag. So the double shot is a little bit worse than usual. GL player right here. We do have to be pretty careful of this guy. Hopefully we don't get one tapped. He completely whiffed it, which is good. Wow, Wardcliff. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Seeing somebody with a GL is definitely one of the scariest things in the game because it can just one shot you so easily. But if you know they have it, you know, it is pretty easy to juke out. So there's a player in the back over here. This is this a guy we just killed? And I, dude, I can't hit anything. This actually is good though, because uh, we... Bro, Penguin5564, five, five, do you mind not third partying me, bro? Oh, oh, no, 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 no. You're not gonna watch me fall off the map. No, it's not gonna happen. Come on, come on, mantle it. No, bro, <laughs> dude, he really just did that to me. Real quick, I just wanna give a massive thank you to the sponsor of today's video, Blazing Boost. If you guys are ever struggling with LFG groups and you really just can't seem to get anything done, 
Blazing Boost has your back. With over 22,000 five-star reviews, Blazing Boost is easily the most trusted Destiny 2 Sherpa service out there. They offer Sherpas for literally any activity that you can think of, whether that's Trials of Osiris, Nightfalls, or even the new Val of the Disciple Raid and Witch Queen. And for the time being, you guys can use my code GRAVELY at checkout for a 5% discount. Once again, huge thanks to Blazing Boost for sponsoring today's video. You know what? Last game might not have been the best. You know, we may or may not have gotten uh, tossed off the map in our super, which was uh, really bad, but that's not going to happen this time around. There's a player coming around this side right over here. Maybe not. I'm going to go for the shotgun kit. What? <laughs> what is that guy doing? <laughs> okay, okay, bro. I don't know what that guy was doing. I'm not going to lie. This guy might eat all the way around, which would be good for us. But dude, that first guy, bro. What was he doing? I have no idea. There is somebody all the way in the back over here. We're going to go for... Dude! Oh my god, I didn't know he had a last word. Holy hell. That thing just destroyed my health bar, bro. If he didn't go for the melee there, I don't think I uh, win that fight. Somebody is up top over here. I believe this is actually the uh, last word guy. It could be wrong. I don't know, though. It probably isn't. Player aping right here. We're going to go for the shotgun kill on him as well. It's going pretty good so far. Another player in the back. He's... Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm actually going to check if he had Peregrine Greaves right now, bro, because I want to know. Okay, he doesn't have Greaves on. Never mind. That wouldn't have one-shotted us, but that still scared the shit out of me. Pretty sure somebody's over here in the back to my right. This is the guy. Whoa! Why did that do... What did he just hit me with? I actually don't know what that guy's using. There's a player up here. We're going to throw a nade and then maybe wrap around. I feel like this guy could drop down if we're lucky. Maybe not. I... Bro, get out of your scope. <laughs> bro... He actually did not care for his radar at all. Okay, there's another guy in the back. Wow, good nade from him. Another player in the back over here. Dude, stop doing that shoulder charge thing. Good God. Like, he's using it as a movement tool, but I feel like one of these times, he's going to accidentally just blot me in the face for like 150 damage for no reason. I'm going to ape this guy. This is probably a pretty risky choice. He's actually not looking at his radar, which is really good. Slide this. Ooh, yo. No, no, no. Wait, what? He's not dead? Okay, he's going to pop his uh, shield. We're going to go for the shoddy kill on him. I forgot that gave you full overshield, which is pretty good. We still got the kill, though. Another player to, uh, off to my left. Um, Outbreak guy, what are you doing? Are you going to push up? Um, Okay, okay. This guy's sneaking behind. <laughs> I want to see oh, how many times this guy goes around. <laughs> There's no way. There's no way. Oh, no, he found me. <laughs> This guy's actually... Wait, can this break his bubble? Please tell me it can. We're going to kill this guy as well. Um, never mind. He's dead, though, because he jumped out of the bubble, which wasn't a great idea. Pretty sure this is a guy we just killed out of his bubble. Okay, he has more range than us. I forgot they nerfed Eager Edge, so it's really not that good anymore. I don't want to get a uh, back shot right here. Okay, we're going to go for the Eager Edge. Oh, my God. I wasn't even sure if that was going to work. We'll take it. Okay, last kill has to be with a shotgun player right here. We're going to slide in. No, wait, wait, what? He's so laggy. What is that? Okay, we got it. GG's. What the hell? So that is pretty much going to be all of the gameplay that I have for today's video. After using the Xenoclast, this thing was actually pretty damn good, and I do think it is 100% worth grinding for. But as always, if you guys did enjoy this video, I would greatly appreciate it if you left a like and a comment letting me know what you thought. And if you're new to the channel, it never hurts hit that subscribe button. Anyways, it's been Gravely. Peace.